What's up, YouTube? It's Toron bringing you another episode of our Feed the Beast Let's Play. I am currently cutting down some trees. I'm going to be moving these um, over to here, this area here. Uh, that way, they're kind of out of the way. Um, as you can see, I've been working on our our little center here for storage, and I'm going to be moving our machines here momentarily. Um, and I'll show you guys how that's going to look when I'm done. This up here is the storage system. Uh, the stone bricks, or the stone blocks are things that I haven't filled yet, that I'm still working on filling. As I need spaces. Uh, as you can see, we have... We have it working pretty well so far. This this basically is all connected by this system back here. I have a couple battery boxes going into a ender chest, which goes into a sorting machine, which goes into a router. That basically filters everything into the uh, barrels. And then over here, I finally got the um, the quarry set up and going. Uh, so I have three electric electric engines that are powering the quarry that pipe everything into this ender chest, which sends it upstairs. Um, I'm only doing an area as big as the building above us, so that I can start building the floors beneath it. Um, so yeah, you don't have like this huge area yet, uh, but you know, don't shoot at me. I don't have any weapons on me right now. Besides an axe that will eat you. Uh, but basically this down here is uh, going to be the bottom levels of the stuff above. That's where I'm going to put like the water mills and stuff after I get them moved over here. So that's that. Um, I did actually finally create myself, I will show you, I created a couple advanced solar panels finally, I got two which is all I was able to make so far, uh, but those are helping to run the system for the quarry, and when I need to move the quarry to a new place I'll probably just transfer those two and one of the bat boxes with me in order to do so. Um, but, so far, um, it's working pretty well. I don't have any complaints. Um, I have to finish out, I have this stuff on me because I want to finish the windows and the stuff in the basement here. I'm just still debating how I want to finish that. Um... So what I'm thinking is that I'll probably do glass along here and I might break it up every now and then with um, some basalt. Up here you can see I did this window here. Uh, this basically just goes to the roof. And then you have this little double window above it. I'm wondering if I should do this or if it's going to make it feel too small. Yeah, no. That's going to make it feel way too small. Unless I get rid of this window entirely and make this a three-wide door. Am I using the silk touch? Yes. Um. Actually... You, you. I need to make a place for the oak leaves. I need the saplings so I can replant. The spruce leaves. The oak leaves. Oak wood can go. 
All right, so let's make a spot for these leaves really fast. Um, two, three. I forgot that thing's quick. Oak leaves. All right. I don't want that to fill up with anything else. Spruce, oak. As this grows, I'll probably move these around. Um, but I'm, I'm still debating if I want to group things specifically or... I mean, I've grouped most of it pretty easily. It's easy to find pretty much anything I need down here. I even have ingots so I can throw my overflow over here. Uh, let's see. But I was over here now. See, I'm thinking that we'll make this a three-wide door. We'll get rid of that. And then we'll do that. With that and that. Oh, we need to get rid of these two as well. I think I lost the construction foam, which isn't a big deal. That stuff's so easy to make, it's not even funny. There. Much better. This basically just takes us out here to the roof where we can see things. Up here, I have another area where you can kind of see down onto what's happening in the storage room. Uh, you can kind of see. I'm actually going to do some really cool village houses using the micro blocks. I'm going to start rebuilding. I'm actually going to do my thumb craft area over near that tree. And I need to move these uh, wheat farms. To a better location. But for now, it works. So, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to finish up this area down here. I'm wondering if I should do like a. Uh, a border along the top. Double that up and then put the glass here or something, or maybe do a border on the bottom. No, because then I can't see out very easily. We'll have to see what this looks like here, real quick. This, though, needs to be one more thick. Seriously? Give back. Thank you. All right. Arr. I growl at you, computer. All right. The only thing I hate about planes is uh, pains. Is there a pain to place sometimes? Now that doesn't look half bad. Um, I think if I'm going to do that though, I probably should go up top and do the same thing maybe. Make it a double level and uh, make it a double on the top as well, a double brick. Or I can just leave it as a single, um, but I don't know, I think I like the double a little bit better. It gives it a different type of a border. Though, no, I think I'm going to get rid of that and make it a... No. 
What I think I'm going to do is make it... Um... I'm just going to... Do the same thing I did up top. And that's have it go from top to bottom. There we go. And because of the two over here on this doorway, that's why I put two on this way, so it's kind of, you know, symmetrical. And though I need to do the same thing over here. Otherwise, it looks funny to me. I don't know. There we go. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and finish putting glass and stuff down there. And then we'll work on moving um, the other machines over soon. Uh, at least the... Because uh, what i got to do is once... Um, I'm waiting for the the dig the uh, quarry to be finished so that I can move my water mills, and then I can move the electric machines over. Uh, but until then, I can at least move this and this, this, uh, those. Uh, I can move a lot of this stuff over. Because I'm putting I'm putting certain machines in certain places. So what I need to do is finish move finish glassing this out, finish the windows, and then I need to um, move the machines over. Once the core is finished, I need to move the water mills over. Um, which will be a little bit easier because I'll be able to just to design the water mills really quick and not have to worry about it. Because um, I'm planning to put those over here. Somewhere. I'll probably take this first level here, like the first eight blocks, and turn it into a, a like a basement for the building. And then the rest of it will be beneath that. I'll have the water mills and stuff like that. So it's shot pretty good. I'm excited to see where I can take this. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and get back to taking down these trees. Planting some new ones. And finishing out the sides of the building here. And then I'll get back to you guys and show you and get, see what you guys think. So I'll be back to you guys soon. And I'm back. I actually decided to do a little bit of exploring. Um... I did get the stuff I was working on finished. I was just flying around trying to check stuff out. And I found this over here. And I wanted to go check it out. So let's go ahead and see what's here. Alright, where'd you go? Ha ha! Can't kill me. We'll go ahead and get rid of everything. Oh hey look, a steadfast drone. Leave me alone! I didn't do it. I only stole it, I promise. With no intent to give it back. Alright, look. I don't have this stuff to make the, uh... I don't have this stuff. I need to make a uh, a net. How do I make a net, anyways? Net. And that's what it's even called. Oh no, it's a scoop. That's what I want. Scoop. Let's see. Wool and six. 
And... I don't currently see any sheep around me. Stop attacking me! Yeah, that's right. Let's see, I think I saw another... Obelisk thing. Somewhere around here. But I'm not quite sure where. So we're just going to say I haven't seen it. I'll go look for another one later. I tend to see them quite often. When I've watched uh, other Feed the Beast people. When I was first watching the Feed the Beast episodes from other YouTubers, I would see uh, those ugly things. Oh look, it's a spider tree. I bet there's a spider spawner underneath that tree. Let's see, this way should be home. Oh, there it is. Really? You're going to attack me? Bring it on! Sit still already! Oh, I don't have any arrows on me. Gosh dang it. All I gotta do is hit you once, and you're dead. There we go. Uh huh. I stole your stuff, anyways. But now we gotta go this way, I believe. But yeah, I saw, I ran across a couple of those as I was exploring, and I thought I would uh, share with you guys. I've also come across more uh, volcanoes, I guess you can call them, the, bas the basalt hills. And I bet you I'm going to run out of jetpack if I'm not careful. Oh, I still got half my jetpack available. Oh, you missed. Oh, hey, check it out. I got red rock over here. Awesome. I don't think I have any of this stuff right now. Just in case I need some or want some for something later. I may as well grab it while I'm over here. I think some recipes actually require this brick for some stuff. I can't quite remember. I know I've looked at a lot of different uh, recipes and um, just looking at stuff and creative and that. And I know that, it does, that there's some stuff that uses this and I can't remember what it is. How much do I have? Stack 15. Fifty-five. All right, I got two stacks. That's good enough for me. I can always come back here later.
It doesn't seem like it'd be too hard to find. It's 600 blocks or so from, uh, looks like it might be 600 blocks westish, maybe? Oh, hey. What's this stuff here? This would be cracked sand. Very nice. Cracked sand is not good for me right now, but I know where I can get some now. And we're almost back to the home. We will sleep in the uh, the good old bed, and then I will show you guys. Well, I don't need to sleep to show you guys what I've done. As you can see, the glass is done. I've moved these two things in here. I moved that and that here, the coke oven and the uh, blast furnace. And then I have, I, ma I mapped out some pillars for some more of these 3x3 three three multi-block uh, uh, machines, I guess you can call them. Uh, and then... Let's see. Let's see what we got on our little adventure there. Alright, so we got a Steadfast Drone. Red Rock, which we'll go find a place for that in here shortly. Crack Sand. I got a Fortune 3 book. Thaumium um, Ingots. Very nice. Four buckets. Got a little saddles. Silver ingots. A logic matrix programmer. What uses does this have? Huh, it doesn't tell me what uses it has, so... Identifier, what uses does this have? Ah, okay. That's how you get the filters on the routers. Cool. We'll keep that. I got that from killing a wisp. Got some tin, silver, thomium, cocoa beans, some copper, some redstone. Not bad for just finding a couple of those. Um, and we'll take this. And we're going to go put that in our storage. And then, uh, so what I'm doing is I'm waiting for the quarry to finish so we can move the, uh, the water mills next. All right. Uh, cracked. All right. Ooh, I don't have a place for Thaumy being it yet. And we'll 
we'll throw them there. And then... I'm pretty sure I have... Silver up here. Do I not have silver? Alright, I guess I didn't have silver yet. Good, you know do I have copper? Yes. Unless this is a different copper ingot. It is. Wow. Alright, well, we'll put that there. Oh, we have uranium more. Alright, um, I'm running out of spots actually, this is, it's good and annoying at the same time. Let's get our oak leaves somewhere to go. I'm pretty sure I had spruce leaves in me too, there we go. Um, spruce leaves. Oak leaves. Redstone. Um, cobblestone, and regular stone. Alright, I need to give me an arrow. A bow without arrows is pretty much useless. There, now I can use my bow. Sweet! But yeah, you guys, so here we are with everything, with at least two of these things moved. Let's go check on our quarry. Come on. Down on the ladder. There we go. Weird. And toss one of these back. Oh wow. We got two guys with golden suits down there. Dead. And not quite dead yet. Still doesn't look like they dropped anything. And so we take care of things from a distance. Let's just see those creepers. I mean, though, it is pitch black down there. These guys are just going to respawn. Oh, yeah. I dare you to fight me. My sword is super awesome and will kill you. Not see anything good drop. I got a carrot. Yay for carrots. Oh, hey. There's a ravine over here. Awesome. A ravine is always good. Definitely have to check out that ravine after we get everything else over here mined out. Uh, it's pretty far down, too. Wow. Not bad. I love the fact that these things are so quick. My turtle took forever to mine out what he did. 
I mean, granted, the resources are good, but it still took forever. He's already on... Um... 34? Uh, the quarry's already on 34, so... That's awesome. Oh, look! More uranium! Awesome. Is this bauxite or stat other stuff? Bauxite it is. I need the bauxite to make silicone. So that I can use the silicone and make more um I wanna make more Oh, I can't even think. Uh, advanced solar panels. Durr. That's the word I was trying to figure out what I wanted to say. Yeah, no, this is actually uh, looking pretty good. I like it. So we should be soon done with that soon enough. Once that's all finished, uh, then I can move the other machines and stuff over. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make the uh, I'm going to make I'm going to add one empty layer to the floor, and then I'm going to add another layer to make the uh, ceiling for the next floor. That way I can run I can run cable. Actually, I'm going to make it too high so I can walk under there. But I'm going to run make it so I can walk underneath the floor here to run cable and uh, make it a little bit easier to put machines down there and make it look neat. Uh, but yeah, I uh, actually think this is going to be it for the video, you guys. Um, i got quite a bit going on. Uh, we moved the trees. So that now, uh, it's not just cramming over here and it looks a little bit better. Oh yeah, I also did this too. One last thing, I added an entrance over here. So that way it kind of has the end of the entrance there, then you have the one over here that we don't always have to go around the building to get into it. But let me know what you guys think. Uh, the next thing we're going to do, of course, is move all the rest of these machines. Um, let's see. Oh, I don't have any more. Uh, I also organize my ingots that I'm keeping over here. So uh, this chest only has things that don't really go into a, uh, a barrel and then I'm still organizing these but we have the excess empty cells compressed air silicon and hydrogen and then we have extra oh it doesn't like my sword we have extra barrels here to store stuff and then we also have rubber being stored and then a little redstone and then after I get everything moved out of here, I might make this my, um, once I get the rest of this stuff moved, I'm thinking I might make this my, uh, not Thalmcraft, my Miscraft building. It might look pretty good as a Miscraft, I might be able to make it my Miscraft building. Uh, I think it would work pretty well. Have different stuff on different levels. I think it'd be fun. But yeah, you guys. So that's kind of where we're at right now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and cut the video here. I know I said that a few minutes ago, but I'm really going to do it this time. And then what I'm going to do is get this ready to upload. And then um, get it up there so you guys can let me know what you think. But yeah, you guys. Um, I really appreciate all you guys that watch these videos. And as always, leave your comments and suggestions. And if you liked it, hit that like button. But thanks everybody for watching, and I will catch you later. Peace.